let's take a look at the 21 inch Toro Stripe Mower. Handle assembly on this was a piece of cake. The battery compartment door is plastic. Uh, one thing to note is that there's no latch to worry about like on the Super Recycler. To adjust the height of cut, there are two points of adjustment, one in the front and one in the back. I much prefer this over the four wheel adjustment. There is still a cable that you have to deal with but it's one very manageable cable on one side of the handles. This dial controls the speed of the self-propel. I'm only 5'1", so having the handles at a comfortable height is extremely important to me. Thankfully, of the two adjustment options, the lower one is a comfortable setting for me. Let's go ahead and lift this puppy up and see what we're working with. Here is your bar that does the striping. The bar will adjust as you adjust your height of cut. This particular model comes with dual blades. And yes, I know I forgot my gloves. Mowing with the stripe is very comfortable. The mower itself is very light, and as you can see, it is putting some pretty decent stripes in the yard. The striping mechanism is bending the blades, but not excessively, which is gonna allow for more airflow, which in turn lends to a healthier lawn. Let's take a look at the bagging. Right now, this bag is full of grass clippings. So watch, this tells you how light this front deck is. If I wasn't holding it here, it would tip over. You can see that the clippings are getting pushed to the back of the bag. Keeping in mind this does not have the Vortex technology, this is pretty much what I would expect. The sun is in a good spot and here you can see where the stripes are popping. The last thing I wanna mention is that the self-propel is pretty slow, especially in taller grass. I think I covered all of the basics on the new Toro Stripe more. Now, if you have any additional questions, as always, feel free to put those in the comments and I will answer those to the best of my ability. I think that does it. That is it. That is all. I will catch you in the next video.